World Mental Health Day celebration, we recall that the caregivers also do pass through stress or depression. It is always good for the caregivers to assess ways in which the best ways in which they can try to resolve the depressions or the stresses that arose from job from job, rather than play, uh, going back with those stress back at home and causing cases uh, cases of domestic violence or cases of other forms of GBV that may harm the family or the family structures. We cannot also fail to appreciate the fact that also the children do go through stress. Majority of them have even suicidal thoughts or even suicidal success, or successful suicidal attempts. It's also good we need to consider the children and also learn to listen to our children so that we can also be able to assist them to cope with their stress better and also to help them develop better stress mechanism resolutions. This also applies to the healthcare workers. It is also good for every healthcare worker to know the best way possible to sort stress, such as avoiding alcohol, avoiding bettings, avoiding uh, issues of causing homicide or suicidal, and then trying to create good times with your families, improving the, your family relations. As we are celebrating the World Mental Health Day concerning uh, mental issues, there have been a rise of very uh, many problems related to mental health that is causing suicide even in our nation. So today we decided to come out and celebrate with the whole nation and uh, the theme of this year is to prioritize mental, uh, mental health at workplace. There are so many people who are getting affected because of the condition in their workplace. So it is uh, our duty to ensure that the people that you are employing or the people that you are working with are having a good uh, uh, mental health, uh, considering their duties, making sure they have time for their self-care so that we can prevent the rise of mental conditions in our, our country and also in our community. Because of uh, the issues related to uh, stigma, stigma with mental illness, not many people are coming, but through these campaigns we have seen many people coming, though with other complaints of headache, of uh, joint pains, but when we assess them, we are able to confirm that the real cause of all these symptoms is the issues that are caused by the stress. Major symptoms of uh, uh, stress uh, or burnout at work is loss of interest. Uh, you'll find people with negativity uh, related to their work, related to their careers, related to their institutions, the loss of sleep or increased sleep. Increased sleep. Others will present uh, with loss of appetite or increased in appetite, the fatigue. Uh, you feel that you don't want even to associate yourself with other people, so you segregate yourself, you withdraw from social, uh, uh, from the society. Those are some of the symptoms that uh, you can experience and know that all is not well.